Communication provided by Saya Communications. For all your communication needs, it's Saya. Call 892-2900. All right, everybody, time to get rocking here now with the Tuesday edition of the High School Hoopla. We start Section 6, where it's holiday tournament time for Donia High School. Game 1, Maple Grove matched up against Riverside. Let us take you there now as we speak. First basket coming up that you're going to see. Hassan Sadiq right here with the nice little left-handed slam as he took it down hard. Later on for Riverside, it'll be Mark Price with a penetrating move. A little finger flip high off the glass. For Maple Grove, Greg Ewok is going to miss this shot, but Josh Little will follow. And then for Riverside, Armand Bajer is going to pull up, and he's going to pop the three right here. And on the scoreboard, it is Riverside, who goes on to beat Maple Grove. The final tonight is 80-61. to 61. Price finishes with 25 points. The other game, Williamsville South and Fredonia. Williamsville South wins it 61-58. At West Seneca, it is the Rotary Tournament. Game one, West Seneca East against Grover Cleveland in this contest. And you see the nice look down low as West Seneca East gets on the board. But then it's Grover Cleveland who will indeed take over. This is David Barber off the steal and the finish at the other end. And also for Grover Cleveland, James Wesley, center of the lane in traffic, puts it high off the glass. And on the board, it is Grover Cleveland winning this contest at 56 to 51. The other game tonight, Lackawanna and West Seneca West, won by Lackawanna at 61-44. Other scores for you that we have. Kenmore East is a winner this evening. Orchard Park takes care of business against Williamsville North. Bishop Kearney also in the W slot tonight. The Pine Valley Tournament, the consolation game, won by Frewsburg. And the championship game, West Valley gets a 10-point victory there. All right, moving on now to Section 5. Good rivalry renewed here. It is 2-3 and three Penfield, entertaining Fairport. And these two teams split the season series. Last year, we've got the highlight action for you right now. We're going to begin with Penfield taking care of business. It's going to be Josh Stinkauer right here. Nice baseline move in traffic, and then the up and under move, and he also got the foul, went to the line, and made it a three-point play. For Fairport, Steve Greco. Scores. He finishes with 19. And then, taking it all alone by himself is Penfield's Jim Muir, as he will go up and under everybody.